Today, we're gonna do a deep, deep dive on a legendary chase. And this one takes place in Philadelphia where this guy was involved in some kind of domestic dispute and an ambulance was dispatched to pick him up, but he stole the ambulance and he took off. Let's look at how he started off here. Just, oh, terrible crash here. Just smash that car. And it looked like he was surrendering pretty early on in the chase. Like he pulls into his parking lot and I honestly thought he was giving up. But I guess he wasn't ready to do that. And the police came up to the vehicle thinking they could get him out. But that wasn't going to work and only made things worse. Causing him to plow into this police car. See it from a couple angles there. And they come up to the vehicle and it looks like they're going to try something. And they hit him with a taser there. And that did not do what they thought it was going to do. And this guy is just not a quitter. And here comes the vigilante in the tow truck. He wants to end it. But I don't think he planned it out all that well. Like, look at how closely he comes to hitting the civilian car. And it only gets worse. The vigilante driving very recklessly into oncoming traffic. And I just didn't know what his plan was exactly. But the ambulance managed to pull off this really impressive pit maneuver. And apparently the tow truck pierced the tire of the ambulance there. Look at this video from on the ground. Oh, man. Both front tires are flat at this point. And if that wasn't bad enough, here he hits a spike strip and he's dragging it behind him. He's driving up over a lot of curves. He's onto the sidewalk here. And my point is that the wheels are getting wrecked. And there you see the front driver's side tire rolling on the ground. It eventually got to the point where the rim was causing sparks to fly. And the ambulance was on its last legs. He literally drove until the ambulance fell apart. And the cops were right there to rip him out of the ambulance, but he was ready to put up a fight. Of course, he got arrested, and that was the end of this unbelievable pursuit. Thank you for watching, but please follow me on Instagram or YouTube because my videos are being censored here on TikTok, and I'm so tired of it.